case. Laverne? Well, Lisa and Matt, from what we know so far, it does not appear that someone was trying to steal ballots. Other mail was also taken, including a debit card. But this has officials concerned, and there is an investigation underway. I was worried about the ballot because this election means a lot to me. David Peterson is one of about a dozen people in an East Orlando neighborhood who had their vote by mail ballots and other mail stolen. One day on Facebook, I see our Pinewood Reserve Facebook page and there was a picture of a neighbor that was pulling mail out of the water drain and they described that uh, they were finding people's voting ballots and but evidently what's happened is someone has stolen the master key from the post office and so they can open up our whole bank of mail. About a hundred people in the neighborhood used these mailboxes. Not everybody had their mail compromised. Whoever shoved that mail deep down into this storm drain definitely did not want it to be found. Behind me you can see how close the mailboxes are where they took it from. Peterson says he also received a bank fraud alert from a debit card he didn't receive and reported it to the authorities. Orange County Supervisor of Elections Glenn Gilzine was also notified. This is very serious. As we know, people are concerned in this country about mail-in ballots. Are you concerned about the process? I was very concerned. I was extremely alarmed once we heard the news, but we sprung into action and made sure that we were able to get them their ballot in a timely fashion, it's immediately, actually, the very next day. Tell us about the process for people to ensure that they can keep track of their ballot. Please sign up for ballot tracks because that gives you confirmation that your mail-in ballot was actually um, received by us. Or more importantly, come to one of our 22 early voting sites and physically drop it off. We just got our new ballots yesterday, so thank goodness all is right with the world. Supervisor Glenn Gilzine also tells me that people should not worry that someone else could use their ballot. He says they have an extensive process to make sure that the signature on the ballot matches the one that they have on file. And once again, we don't have evidence that someone was trying to steal ballots but of course, this is a serious situation. Yeah, and Laverne, to be clear, investigators believe I mean, these ballots were not taken because they thought they were ballots. They just happened to be in this yeah. mail and- They were just stealing mail yeah. and they happened to it be in there. Collateral yeah. damage. Exactly, yeah. unfortunately, and those envelopes, they're bright colored, they stand out. So the person immediately who found them knew exactly what they were. And luckily they did the right thing. They alerted authorities and alerted the elections office. Well, and the good thing too, is, as the supervisor of elections said, and this is true in any county, you can track your ballot. You can go onto their website, make sure, yeah. you can see where your ballot is and make sure that it's in the right place. Or where place. it's supposed to be. That's right, yeah. Yeah, yeah and we have the link on uh, clickorlando.com. Mm -hmm. Okay, good stuff, Laverne McGee, thank, thank you. you. Well, officials say, they might be seeing more people.